The Legacy of Hope. A Great Venture by Bonaventure. Every day at Mass we say, let us give thanks to the Lord. And it's only right and fitting we should thank the Lord because we owe God so much for all he has done for us. Thank you. Thank you for yesterday. Thank you for all your blessings. Every morning I stand here at my veranda and I look over at Dancing Man, watch the sun rising and I say, thank you, Lord. Thank you every morning. Thank you for a good night's rest. Thank you for a new day. And every evening I go before the Blessed Sacrament and I say, Thank you, Lord. Thank you for all you've done for me today. And it's only right and fitting we should thank him. Here's Joyce. Joyce is from here at the Leprosarium. She's one of the residents here. She's always saying, Thank you, thank you, thank you. Always. She cooks, she cleans, she washes. She even farms. And she always says, she never complains, she never complains. Even though her disability from leprosy, you know, is here, you can see the fingers missing. But yes, she's always giving thanks. And that's how it should be. Just like those 10 lepers, only one came back to say thank you. The rest went off to celebrate. And they forgot to say thank you. We should never forget to say thank you. God forgive us. We should be thankful people, not thankless people. Say thank you, thank you, thank you for our, our family, for our health, for our children, for our parents, for our education, for our work. Thank you, thank you for all of these. That's what we should say every day. The word thank you should always be on our lips as we give thanks to God for all he has done for us. Let us be thankful people, full of thanks, not thankless people. May God bless us that today and all days will be a thankful day.